three techniques of how I manifested my own place. So if you are that person that is going through a stage in your life now where you want to get your own place, you don't know how to go about it, this video is for you. So please watch this video till the end. I moved into Lagos in 2021. Um, and just like everyone else that just moves into Lagos, I squatted with different people, moved from one house to another. It wasn't easy. Hey guys, how are we all doing? Welcome to the crib. I know, I know I said I was back now, but it doesn't look like I'm back, but I promise I'm back. It's just that I've been busy lately with a lot of things, like I'm trying to launch my new business and that has really been taking my time, guys. Yeah, if you want to know what I'll be launching, just click the link on the description and join my wait list so that you get to be among the first set of people that are going to get my product, okay? and to my new viewer hey new friend welcome to the crib thank you so much for clicking on the link to actually watch my video it really means a lot to me for doing that you and i both know how clicking on random links can be on the social media so thank you so much for clicking on my link to watch my video and please do not forget to hit the subscribe button and also the notification bell so you get to be notified when i post new content and also you get to be among the first set of people to get updates on my new videos okay okay i'm already talking too much so let's just jump right on to today's video about how i manifested my own place so if you are that person that is going through a stage in your life now where you want to move from your parents house or you want to get your own place and you're stuck there and you're confused or you don't know how to go about it this video is for you so please watch this video till the end because it's going to help you and at the end of this video i am going to be dropping three techniques of how i manifested my own place so let's go so i moved into lagos in 2021 um, and just like everyone else that just moves into lagos you know how it be i squatted with different people moved from one house to another and it wasn't easy but i'm actually very very grateful to everyone that could keep up with me living with them i'm really really grateful for them so i have always wanted my own place like i've always wanted it so much I know I apart from my own place that I had in uni like I've always wanted my own place like this is where I call home you go home and this is your place I've always wanted that so I remember I always imagine myself in my own place things I'll be doing the content I'll be creating and all that and during that time also I was like using words of affirmation like if, if you ask me oh where do you stay I, back then i was staying on the mainland but i would say that oh i stay on the island I, I was just saying it and i remember i was having a talk with someone and the person was like why do you keep saying you stay in Naja when you stay on the mainland i was like because that's where i'm going to stay that's where i'm going to live i see myself living there so i would literally be feeling form and be writing that as my address like i'll see myself there living on the island like I didn't see myself living on any other places. That doesn't mean I have an issue living on the mainland. I lived in the mainland for like two years before I moved to the island. So it's not that. The mainland is actually a very, very good place, very nice place to stay. It has its own kind of energy and the island has its own kind of energy. I actually remember that back then I, I was still doing my NYSC and when we go for CDS my friends would be going back home to the island and I'll be going back to the mainland and I would always tell them that don't worry very soon I'll be going home with you guys to the island and they'll be like yay yes <laughs> so yeah and fast forward to now I'm living here now and I'm having this whole new experience it's all like adding up and making sense to me now. Thinking about how I got my place now, it's fascinating to me that I did not struggle to get this place because we all know how getting a place in Lagos can be. Like it is stressful, frustrating, and can even be depressing sometimes. But I didn't go through that stress to get a place, and it was everything that I wanted the lighting, the space, the ventilation literally like in a serene environment it was everything that i wanted so these are three manifestation techniques that i actually use to manifest my place number one is visualization boy oh boy i visualized ah i visualized there like i literally saw myself living there 
like I didn't see myself living anywhere else other than that. And I had this picture of how I wanted my place to be. When the right time came for me to have it, it had everything. And number two technique I used was um, affirmations like using your words to affirm that you're already living there like when i'll tell my friends that don't worry i would live on the island soon if you asked me where i was living i would mention that area that location that address i was just seeing myself living there and number three technique which is the last technique was actually journaling i actually wrote down just like the bible says write a vision habakkuk 212 that says write a vision and make it plain i journaled everything I would tell you that every single details that I wrote about how I wanted my place to be I got it it was everything so guys manifestation do work you should try it so that's the three main technique that I actually used to manifest my own place you should try it because it is definitely a game changer it is magical it is miraculous whatever you want to call it okay so Thank you for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed yourself. I know some of you have not clicked on the subscribe button. Yeah, I know you. We, we know ourselves. So please hit the subscribe button and also the notification bell so you do not miss the next video because I'll be dropping another one real soon. Okay? And also, you can get to connect with me on my socials, on Instagram, TikTok, Snapchat, and any other platform that I am because I don't really know how I'm in so many platforms that I've, I've even lost count and I will leave them the links on the description box and also it will be on the screen somewhere so yeah so thank you so much once again for watching my video I really enjoyed the time thank you so much for watching this video hope to see you next time on the crib bye